If you love chickpeas and comfort classics, chickpea pot pie will be right down your alley. It is one of my favorite recipes that I've ever created, so obviously I had to include it in my debut vegetarian cookbook, Here's how to make it. Everything happens in one pan. I like to use a cast iron because it can go from the stove to the oven. Saute up your flavor base until everything's a bit soft, then remove that from the pan and throw in some butter. We're going to make that thick and rich sauce that pot pies are known for. Flour helps to thicken it up, and then we'll add some vegetable broth and heavy cream along with some seasonings to turn it into a rich and velvety sauce. Add those veggies back into the sauce along with some frozen peas and of course our chickpeas. Stir all of that together and it is totally acceptable to have a few spoonfuls at this point because that makes Texture is so tasty. Now with the crust you can get as fancy or as not fancy as you want. I like to cut my crust into strips like this and then weave them together to give it that classic look. But you could also just put a whole pie crust on top of it and cut some slits in it to let the steam escape. Or if you want to change it up you could get some biscuits like the refrigerated biscuits that come in a can and just stick them right on top. Brush the top of the dough with egg which is going to help to make it shiny and brown and then throw the whole thing in the oven. This is one of the most comforting meals that you will catch me making all year round. It's also really great for meal prep. You can make the whole thing and then just don't bake it until you're ready to eat it. This chickpea pot pie is just always a hit with people who eat meat and people who don't. It has a ton of five-star reviews on my site. I know you're going to love it. Let me know if you try it out and happy cooking.